Hello everybody, welcome to Dragon Town, and today I'm going to teach you how to mod Blade and Sorcery for your windows. Easy as pie. But before I get started on that, I just want to say it would really mean the world to me if you dropped a like on the video and perhaps maybe subscribed. You know, drop a comment at the end of it saying it helped or what your favorite mod is. Also another thing, if you go to my homepage, you could check out my other videos that I make. I don't just do tutorial stuff actually make funny videos like I have a series on Skyrim VR I do Call of Duty stuff I do virtual desktop shorts Harry Potter you know all the bada bing bada boom baby and with that being said let's get started with the video all right so first things first we need to download vortex and to download vortex we need to go to nexusmods.com the link will be in the description for that so just check down there once you click the link, you'll be brought to this page, but first you need to create a profile if you don't already have one. Make sure you're signed in, you can create one in the top right corner here. Once you have your account made and signed in, you just click the download vortex button here. It'll download vortex, I'm not going to do that, but I'll show you the process. You click it and then it brings you to this page. Just scroll down to files and then click vortex. Manual download. It'll bring you to this page here. It tells you that you need to download Net 6.0. Uh, you want to go ahead and do that, so just open a new page with that. And then click the direct link here. It'll download as a Windows Desktop. So as that's downloading, you want to go back to this page and click download for your uh, Vortex. And then click slow download. It'll download in 5 seconds. But we're not going to do that because I already have it downloaded. It'll download. Um, once you have it downloaded, you want to install the Windows runtime thing that you downloaded previously. Uh, click install, do that, and then after you install that, you want to install Vortex. And once you're done installing Vortex, you want to open Vortex. So go ahead and search in the search bar Vortex. You'll be able to bring it up. And then once you bring it up, you'll be met with this screen. You could have a click here to log in or whatever, or you can go to the top right here and then click login on website and it'll boot up this tab and you just click authorize and it'll log you in. Now that we're signed in on the app, we want to go down to where it says games and then we want to find our blade and sorcery. We want to click manage. Now, sometimes when you click manage, it usually works, but sometimes people will be asked to find the manual location. So. We want to go to click these three dots and then click set manual location and essentially it's just where you install the game um i don't know where you'll install it but usually by default it's installed in the program files in steam so you just go to steam steam apps common find your blade and sorcery file and it should manage it um just click manage easy done now we're ready to install some mods so uh, go to the description, click the second link in the description, which will be the Blade and Sorcery mod page. And then once we're in here, we want to download a couple mods. So we're going to download the Cult. Uh, we're going to scroll down to Popular of All Time and then click the Outer Rim with Vortex. And then you want to click Slow Download. And then for the Cult, Vortex. Okay, so with this one, we need an extra mod, so we just uh, install that one as well. Click Vortex. That. Slow download. Wait for it. Uh, click download. Slow download. And it should automatically load into the Vortex app, so let's go ahead and see. Alright, all the mods have finished downloading. Now we want to go to the Mods tab, and anything that we see not installed, never installed, disabled, we want to click it. You just want to click it, enable it, install it, extract it. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. 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 Um, boom, enabled. Now you have mods. It was that simple. Now we just have to go run our game. We just click the little play button here and it'll automatically run the game for us. All right, so step one, we're making it past the loading screen, which is a good sign. We're in the game. So, looks like we got our guns. Hmm? 
<laughs> okay, we like to see it. Where's the... Yes, here's Star Wars. And we get to see the names of it. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Let's see, Anakin. Anakin, yeah, we want Anakin. Actually, let's go ahead and change it. We want a red crystal. Yes! Get that shit out of my way! <laughs> you don't even know you're dead. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Alright, perfect. Now that we know it works. So, yeah. Good job. Good job, everybody. Have fun. Good luck, have fun. Drop a like, drop a subscribe, drop a comment, watch my other stuff. Hook me up as I hooked you up. Take care, everybody.